visited Austin, um, I happened across the Hope Outdoor Gallery. I was just struck by the amount of art that I saw, the amount of people kind of, you know, it seemed to corral around this place. It seemed like it was a real hub. You know, I immediately called DJ and was like, wow, man, we got to do something with this place. So I just did some research and found Andy. Just a simple conversation and some ideas to, you know, almost a year later when we were invited down, you know, finally we put this proposal together to build a wall out of a thousand recycled spray cans on site. One of the first things that you know we we found when we at least kind of established our process in Venice is that you need collection bins. You need a place where people can dump spray cans. And so the first thing we had to do was organize, you know, with the help of Spray TX, just collect these thousands of cans through all the artists. When you're working with you know the right people and that are capable and, and you know and willing to kind of put the time and effort, yeah, I mean it's amazing what you can what you can create. Paul has been um, my dear, dear friend for about 10 years, and we had met in advertising as interns together. When it came down to it, can love was the one thing that sort of brought us solid together, you know, in, in doing a, a creative adventure that was, was something we both could, you know, equally participate in. I happen to be an artist, he happens to be a really great thinker, and so I think we've always kind of worked well together. Big, big love and shout out to my father, Dennis. He always wants to be a part of whatever I'm doing. You know, it's, it's amazing to have the support of someone that will give you anything you need, you know, without question. And so he's, he's, he's come with us for a couple, couple different things. We had a show, um, a big show in San Francisco. He was there helping set up. My mom too, uh, but my dad I think is the kind of guy he's like you're going to Montreal I'll, I'm coming to Montreal and he just he comes he flies out came flew out to Austin and you know broken arm and everything he was he was in it to win it he wanted to help you know They really helped us out with just kind of a setting to build this thing. And then with the help of Art Scene Alliance, who built the actual structure of the fencing um, and installed it for us on site, we were able to, after we put the panels together, just simply go and install the panels on the fence posts that were already there for us. You know, I think our, our hopes for Can Love in the, in the immediate future is to continue refining our process. We found ways to make things quicker and more efficient, and that way we can hopefully, in time, start to spread what we're doing in different places and teaching others, and giving them the tools to do the same thing, um, or doing with us, you know, to, to recycle more. I mean, we're artists and we're also people. So I think in the future it's, you know, it's, it's more. Yeah.